Hello my little mermaid friends. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Mermaid Star Gamer, but you can call me Amanda. Today we are continuing the Black Widow Challenge with Apollo and hopefully finishing it. If you haven't watched the previous episodes, I suggest you do so. I have the link for the Black Widow Challenge in the top right corner here somewhere, maybe. Yeah. Or you can find it in the description box below. <laughs> Please like and subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you don't miss any videos I put out. Okay, let's get into it. Okay, so last episode, we Yuki, Megumi, Junko was not one, Julia. I think we did like three different people last episode. This episode, we're doing Amaya and Nanami. We have seven. seven people now so the pool I think was too big so I'm gonna make it smaller there that should be good now oh I'm so sad I lost Yuki I'm gonna have to give yourself a pep talk and you still need to kiss 10 sims so you'll be getting that today your romance is at 93% complete on level eight and your charisma is at level six so cool you're getting there apollo there's so many puddles okay what are you at two days if you guys didn't know apollo is actually from my series the seven baby challenge you can go ahead and take a look at it in the top right corner. If you want to look at that, he was actually such a sweetheart. He was lactose intolerant, I think, when he was a kid. And now he's the Black Widow. It didn't make sense, but that's what he rolled. So make sure you go take a look at that. It was quite, what's the word? Aggravating? <laughs> His mom drove me crazy. She, no, no, no. Hey neighbor, I'm bored. I mean, Amaya. I gotta get better. I'm at 20 hours, I guess you can come in. Before you get hit by lightning. She's just chilling there in the rain. In the thunder and the lightning. Hi, you can come on in. I'm sad. I'll be sad for 11 more hours. I need to go calm down now. Excuse you, this is my mirror. I need it to keep me, give myself a pep talk. Why are you angry? Thanks, I'm gonna go back to my mirror. Cause I'm broken hearted. Oh, he's getting flirty, I see it. Seven more hours. She needs to calm down before you actually like do anything with her. You do know there's more mirrors. There's a mirror right here. So if you need to calm down, go over here to the mirror. I'm gonna go play your game. You do that. More puddles. It's probably from the rain. Cause it is pouring down rain. Look at that. Wow. Fox, now. Fox is also from my seven baby challenge so you can watch him grow up as well he also has a um his own challenge that i did i did the homeless to famous so if you want to take a look at that his is also going to be in the description box below um he's finished so you can watch from start to finish apollo is hopefully going to be done today he has uh, seven brothers, seven brothers and sisters, Forrest, Azrak, Indigo, and Hyacinth are the ones that are left. With my work schedule, I'm trying to come up with a schedule that I can record, but because I was, my schedule was just 
really messed up. I didn't have a set schedule. So now I have a set schedule. I'm going to be able to record more for you guys. And it's going to be a little bit more like, like how it used to be. Not so Barry was on Wednesday, but it's going to be on Thursday, which, yeah. Then, um, uh, what was it? Black Widow is going to be Fridays, but this is going to come out Saturday, which is today for you guys. Not for me. <laughs> I'm trying to get into the swing of things. <laughs> Flirty. Tender neck kiss. Rawr. You like goosing her, so go ahead and goose her again. Oh, she likes it too. Hey, neighbor. That would be Red. Red is... Which one was he? He was the alien adoption one. No, I will put all the kids that have com I've completed their uh, their challenges in the description box below. Indigo is kind of finished. Hers is really long. She's doing the farm life one, and that's a long time. So, but I'm gonna go back to her after this one because she was the very first one that we started. So we need to go and check in on her, which I think I said this last episode for Black Widow, but I'm just going to reiterate. <laughs> Woohoo in the observatory. No, let's not. Actually, let's woohoo in the hot tub. Then, ooh, Apollo can now lovingly dip kiss other Sims. I got to see this one. What are you wearing? I'm not even going to try try and figure it out anymore and you're still broken okay of course she's like I'm hungry I'm gonna go eat your whatever I think it's tacos no I want to see what this one is let's see um lovingly dip kiss she said nah I'm gonna go eat your food no you're not you're not gonna eat my food you're not gonna eat my food I'm going to dip kiss you. Oh, that's cute. Hey, you want to be romantic partners? Yay! As he has a freaking handcuff. At least it's better than a ball and chain. I think we should possibly move in together. Oh. Fine, leave. It's only six o'clock. I'm going to get some leftovers. You go get some leftovers of yours at your house. And then I'm going to ask you to come over. And maybe propose. Oh, look who it is. Kathleen. Why are you acting like you can see through my walls? Are you a superhero? You're going to need to leave. Here, we'll exchange numbers and then you got to go. Because if you're a superhero, you can see what this room is. And the Deadpool. She's bored. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. You need to go away. Because I'm inviting my girlfriend over. Aw. She's like, Mwah. Mwah. Amaya will be right over. Thank you, Kathleen. Oh, and she's going to walk right into the house. Yeah. You don't have an apartment key, but, oh, she's going to ask to move in. Can I move in? Yes, I'd love that. Give me your money. Give me your money. Oops. Now give me your money. Woo. Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Um, hey, you want to propose? You want, you want to be my wife? My eighth wife yes I would love to eighth times the charm right I think it's eight yeah it's eight let's get married elope immediately I don't want to wait we need to get married right now moochie peachy <laughs> Yay, we're married. Now, let's go ahead and consummate our love. Because I'm very tired. 
Apollo, my love, you need to get up. Uh, suggest back-to-back woohoo. <laughs> hey, you want to do back-to-back woohoo? Whoa! Dangerously tired. Hey, no. No. <laughs> Come back over here. Woohoo with Amaya. He's like, I'm so tired. I'm gonna fall asleep. Well, oh, Junko. All right, well, you're just gonna have to go to the bath. Go to bed, Apollo. She is not dying. Dangerously tired, but you're not tired enough. Okay, Amaya, come over here and work out. Just like, don't mind if I do. You need to sleep for a little bit longer, like a little bit, because I need you to come over here and kiss hands with Adelaide. There we go. Amaya is dying from overexertion. Bye, Amaya. He's like, hey, I can finally get to the body. It's not in a pool. This is awesome. I can do my job. Do your job, Grim. She's angry. <gasps> Goodbye, Amaya. Okay. He's like, I'm so tired. Paolo has learned Junko's romantic boundaries. Oh no, what happened? Slight discontent from being unsatisfied in a romantic relationship. And she's gone. I'm a widower, yet again. <laughs> Grim got scared from Junko. Grim's getting down with some music. We should be like best friends, Grim. Did you break it again? You guys, like freaking. Stop breaking my stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Huh? One, two, that's six, seven, eight. Where'd my other one go? Did I put it on the wall? No. I don't know where it went. He should be on nine. No. Let's see. Julia? Adelaide, Amaya, Junko, Nadia, Megumi, Becca, Yuki. You are totally married to her. You didn't get one. Unless it was in her inventory. Oh, yeah, that's what it was because she asked him to marry her. There we go. Okay, so two more. All right, sad Apollo. Sad panda. Come over here and take a shower. Yeah, I know you smell. Then you're gonna come over here with your red shoes. Give yourself a pep talk. Oh my goodness. Hey Apollo, I think I have a crush I don't even know who you are. Sure. Romance is in the air. Oh, is that that one guy that you were talking to downstairs? Apollo and Becca have a strong romantic relationship and will now each independent, will not need, bleh, 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 and will now each have independent romantic satisfaction levels. Um. I'm pretty sure you already had romance when you were alive, but just saying. I don't know, are you sick? I'm so sad. Why is your hygiene going down so fast? You're not doing anything. 
Now, you need to wash your hands because that's the reason why it's going so fast now. There we go. 17 more hours. You need some medicine. Because for some reason, orange juice and sleepy time does not work in my game. We gotta do the medicine thing. I'm feeling very unsatisfied in a relationship. If you are mean to me while I feel this way, our romantic relationship will suffer. Says the ghost. Ten more hours. Yes, Kathleen? No, thank you, Kathleen. Paolo has taken medicine and has successfully combated his cold. Go open Cupid's Corner. Um, let's see. Gonna have to get rid of Agatha. Hillary. Lazuli. Rochelle. Lily. Paula. Is that Paula, what's her face? The one with all the money? I can't remember her last name. Add to contacts. I'm feeling flirty. No, I'm going to create the date. Ooh, amazing compatibility with number nine. Invite over to current lot. Sliding into your DMs there, Paula. Sure. Paula Sherman will be right over. Hi, Summer. Bye, Summer. Oh, she's walking right in. I don't think that is her. Bold pickup line. Deggity, deg, deg, deg. Hey, Paula. Would you like to be my number nine wife? My wife number nine? Tell unbelievable story. Stop, you're not sick. You just took medicine. Flirt. Kiss hands. No one can resist <laughs> your kissing their hands. As she's holding a lump of clay. She's like, ooh. Offer rose. Ooh. Earn gold on three dates. I mean, I guess I have to do. No. Maybe we're not going to do that. Um, all right, I guess we're going to go ahead and go on a date. Create a date. I'll do it right here because I love my house. Romantic date. All right, and we're going to go here. We're going to do be romantic, physical intimacy, and woohoo. And septuplet ro romance. Septuplet residence. Romantically socialize. Talk about physical intimacy. Light physical intimacy. Passionate kiss. That's intimate. Emotionally connect. How is that light physical intimacy? Kiss. Oh. Lower kiss. Lovingly dip kiss. Whisper about desires. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Hold hands. That's, oh, there we go. Talk about, talk about woohoo and talk about physical intimacy. Paulo and Paulo are very satisfied with their relationship. Exchange numbers. Paula and a Paula. Paula and Apollo are being steamy, okay? She's like, oh my goodness, I like him. He likes the older ladies. Four hours, I need to have some more time. Has to be romantic partner. Yes, yes I will. Cheese. How do I talk about woohoo? More choices, no. Flirtation. Recap woohoo, I'm guessing. So, this is all the people that I've had woohoo with. 
An interaction related to this goal can be found in the friendly pie menu category under small talk. Sweet. Friendly, small talk. It's about time they do that. Um. Get to know. They're talking about underwear. You just found out about f Paula's financial status. Okay. And she's okay with that. Ask about day. Alright, we're just gonna have to woohoo. Come on. Let's go woohoo. You're not gonna get a gold because I cannot find it. Talk about marriage? Oh, you have red shoes too. Offer a rose. Kiss hands. Light physical intimacy. Kiss hands. Kiss hands is light. Lovingly dip kiss. Oh, you want to woohoo again? Well, I'm sorry. You can't woohoo. You're going to kill her. And we need her. Passionate kiss. Just back to back woohoo. No. Did she just take a picture of me? Um. Share some personal details, maybe? I want a woohoo and a rocket with you. I want to take you to the moon. <laughs> or six them. Paula. Apollo clued Paula in. Apollo clued Paula in on some personal details about his life. Paula has learned Apollo's career and Apollo's financial status. She's like, oh my god, you're rich. I love you. I cannot woohoo with you again. I mean, hey, can I have a loan before I kill you? Before we get married and I don't see it. Get to know. I'm feeling very unsatisfied in our relationship. You're fun to be around. Paula is socially awkward. Can I add some more time to our date? And date cheerfully. Date interactions. Um, ask to extend the date. Extend the date, Apollo. You have 33 minutes. Sure, you can have more time. Two hours. I need more time. More time. I don't know where it's at. I can't ask about anything. Talk about casual intimacy. Discuss woohoo on TV. I mean, let's see. It's okay to be a little awkward. That's cute. Wow. Talk about casual intimacy, maybe? That's physical intimacy. Oh, that worked. Flirt. Flirt, 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 flirt. Keep it going. I want to know what you have. That looks gold to me, but gold is usually over here. Yeah, that's silver. So I need more time. Can I have more time, please? Be affectionate. Successfully run any interaction under the romance pile category and under affection. Look deeply into her eyes. You should be getting a gold right after this. Oh, but we got to do enticing, maybe? No, we'll do... Mm. Express fondness. No, I need more. I need to be affectionate with you. Yay! Oh, you want to flirt again. Um, flirt. Kiss. Mm, red shoes again. I really like your slippers. They're red. I have to pee, Apollo. Um, let her go to the bathroom. Otherwise, she's going to pee her pants, and it's going to be a bad date. And besides, you're sick. Take some medicine. I need to do some light 
physical intimacy. Uh, kiss. Upper rose. <laughs> Megumi's like, oh my god, it's Apollo. It's Apollo. I love you, Apollo. I need more time. <laughs> I need more time, Paula. No, I want a gold. I need more time. <laughs> Extend. Because I need to pee. <laughs> then I need to be affectionate with you. Look deeply into her eyes. Come on, I need you to go to the bathroom. Uh, then we can go ahead and look. Express fondness. She's like, I'm going to go eat some food. I'm starving. You've kept me here for over 12 hours, I think. You'll be fine. Take a chill pill. At least you're not in the water. In the dead pool. Adelaide and Apollo's relationship has fizzled away. Sorry. Oh darn. And you're stuck here forever. Ha, ha, ha. Express fondness. Turn that off. Oh, you're so close to a gold. So close. I need a gold. I need a gold. Flirt with her. Flirt. Come on. Yay! Now. Date actions. And date cheerfully. Get leftovers. If you can hear that, Lexi's chewing her bone. Like, right. Right. Right, right there. Oh, there she is. We got a gold! Wow, that was such a legendary date. Your sim was on fire out there. There's a gift in your sim's inventory to help you remember such a great time. Cherished memory portrait. Cool, so you get the same thing for each of them. Okay, well, oh. aww. Cute. Can I move in? Oh, maybe not. So soon. No. I mean, you can if you want. Ask to join household. Hey, Paula. How about you? You want to move in? Sure. Let's move in together. Oh, you're not the one. Oh, well. She, she's like, bye. Where are you going? <laughs> Alrighty then. Okay, go ahead and go to the bath. Go take a shower because you're dirty again. And go to sleep. Paula, where are you going? Why don't you come over here and nap? Here. This is your house. You have a house now, Paula. I mean, you could sleep there if you really wanted to, too. Whatever. Whatever. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Amazing date. Apollo is bouncing off the walls with ZZZ. With excitement after that date, he can't wait to gush to another sim about such an amazing time. Why does it say that you... I'm so confused. What is your issue? Do I need to kill you right here and now? You good now? Like, you gonna sleep for a while? No, of course not. All right, whatever. Come here. Why can't I? I'm so confused. What is going on? I reset my game, so hopefully this will work. Okay, that works. Where are you, Paula? Why are you down here? Go home. Come on, Paula. Come home. Your boyfriend wants to see you. Put some clothes on, Apollo. Make it look like you worked out. I worked out, babe, while you were gone. Sure, you like fitness. What are you doing? Okay, now, let's see, can I propose to you? 
And don't say, oh, no, oh, it, things are going so fast. We just met yesterday. Well, we did, but still. Paula, will you be my, what are you, ninth? My ninth wife, please. Yes, I will. Mwah. All right, let's get married. No, you're not loyal. Elope immediately with Paula. Make this go a little faster. Because this is number nine. And I think number 10 is going to be, what's her face? Or maybe she'll be 11. No. We're stopping at 10. Where are you going? Hey, hello. What are you doing? I don't like you. You're, you do things on your own. I don't, I don't like that. <laughs> All right, come over here. We're gonna go woohoo in the blanket. Come, woo come, Paula, let's woohoo. And do it again. Looks like your place doesn't need my services today. Yeah, no, no ghosts really came over. They're kind of mad at me. Okay, she's grungy. Wo mm, can't woohoo in the hot tub. Suggest so back-to-back -back woohoo. You smell really, really bad. You guys can't go through the door? No, of course not. We're just going to walk right through the glass. Yeah. Mm. Wonderful. You act like a snob, but you stinky. With your red shoes. She does have a yellow nightgown, so it was like meant to be. I need to take a shower. Unsatisfied. It's because I'm so stinky. All right, fine. He's like, I'm going to sleep. Why are they not cuddling? Woohoo with Paula. I don't know why she's not getting tired. Level two romance for Paula. Back to back woohoo. Need to go. No, sorry. Sorry, babes. All right. Well, do you have it yet? No, you don't have it. Okay. Well, go ahead and work out. I'm gonna get rid of you somehow, Paula. I'm extremely tired. Well, guess what, <sighs> babes? We're totally gonna woohoo. I don't know, Apollo. Okay, we'll do it. Ooh, he's almost maxed out on romance. Do it, do it, do it. You're still here, and now it's gone. Guess what? You're going to... I guess you can't die from that, so... Go work out. Go get some leftovers, Apollo. I don't get it. Where did her thing go? I'm going to get rid of you one way or the other. Okay, go to the bathroom. Take a shower. Can you work out yet? Probably not. Well, that's booty. All right, well, really? Apollo, get up. We got to get rid of her somehow. Go woohoo with Paula. When it's freezing cold. Are you dead? Yay! <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Got rid of her. <laughs> Goodbye, Paula. Now I'm gonna be so sad. He's like, <gasps> I've never seen my wives die. Maybe Junko. And then we get a rando. Oh my gosh. Go away. I'm just going to need you to come over here. Actually, who is next? Who is number 10? Nanami. Nanami. <laughs> we could do Nanami. Becca's like, oh, not another one. Oh, I'm so sad. 
I'm not. She was annoying. Oh, he's still flirty. Um, it's too late. Sorry. You might as well go ahead and take a cold shower with your red sandals. Okay. He's very flirty. Oh, he's very happy. I'm so happy. Mop that up, please. Oh, we need to do... Here. Um, Grim. No. I need to watch this premiere. Sorry. Bye! You need to go watch the premiere before it's too late. You have a half hour. TV season premiere was awful. I mean, I think you can do a date. Why don't we do a blind date for our last one? We got silver last time, so let's go for the gold. We'll be romantic, physical intimacy, and woohoo. And we're gonna have it here. Who are you? Look at who is here. It's your blind date, selected by our very own, very qualified specialist at Cubic Corner. I hope you have a great date. Thanks. She's gonna love Briley. She's gonna love having all these ghosts around. Romantic introduction. All right, we're, we'll do romantic introduction. <laughs> well, are you single? Do you like grilled cheese? What? Apollo? He's like, I don't like her. Yeah, smooth apology, please, because you freaking... I'm so sorry for your loss. It's okay. Bold pickup line. I don't like her. Oh, no, you just got really sad. All right. Briley, I'm sorry, but we're going to have to end this date. End the date cheerfully. Unfortunately, we will have to do this again some other time because I'm ex so sad. Blind date unsuccessful. Well, you know what? His wife just died. I need to go give myself a pep talk. I'm feeling very unsatisfied in our relationship. Stop breaking my stuff, Julia. She just like died in front of me. I'm so sad. Really? You can't come over here and mess up my room. Otherwise, I'm going to get rid of your urn, whoever you are. Yo, anyone up there? Oh no, another summer. Wonderful. Come on, Apollo. Get rid of this. You got nine hours. Yay, he's feeling better. All right, ask to create a date. <laughs> he's like, hey, you're here. So you want to do a date? Romantic date. Same thing, because it works. Ask to seductive dance. That's just weird. First kiss. <laughs> it's funny going faster. Why do you not have pants on? Put some pants on. Oh, hello. She was like, yes, please. Lovingly dip kiss. Hi, Hyacinth. She's like, ugh. My life is so boring. Oh, yeah, Apollo. Good job. You had like nine wives die, and you're still going for it. I love you, bro. Ooh. Apollo can now perform aura of flirtiness on himself. Romance level 10. So how do we do that? Aurora, aura of fitness. That's to be romantic partner. Woohoo and blanket. Sure. Offer Rose. Hey neighbor, I'm bored. Yes, you're steamy. Bye, Hyacinth. You might want to leave now. That's a cute dress. Maybe because it's pink, I like it. I like it a lot. Flirt, flirt, flirt. Oh. 
What did that do? He's got so much pink. Passionate kiss. Make out. Propose? No, we're not going to propose. We're not going to make it awkward. Build up partner. We need to flirt. Flirt, 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 flirt. Talk about woohoo. Ask about career. Oh, she's cold. <laughs> I mean, oh, sure, I'd love that. Ooh, you have a little bit more money, too. Thank you. How about we go woohoo in the observatory? That'll warm you up. And then we have to warm up with body heat. Then let's go ahead and do some flirts. Some flirt alerts. Oh, you're going up his booty. Couldn't wait for him to move, huh? Are you cold, too? You're not cold. He's like, no way. I'm not. Not cold at all. Kiss cheek. Like physical intimacy, that should be one. And... Sure, you like physical intimacy. Um, embrace. He's getting faster at this. Be affectionate. Kiss hands real quick for me. Offer rose. Be affectionate. Build up partner. Briley just had her first experience understanding a positive or resilient romantic outlook. With enough of these kinds of experiences, the Sims can develop a, the romantic sage trait. As she already passed her impressionable formative, formative years, this trait will be slightly harder for Briley to develop. Oh, it's because she's an adult. Okay. I need more time, more time to woo you off your feet. I don't know why. Well, I'm just going to try and propose because I'm not going to get it. She's going to be like, no. <gasps> She's going to say yes. Yay. Victim number 10. Warm up with body heat. Let's go ahead and elope immediately. I can't extend the date either. I can't even say, hey, we're going to end the date. No. Well, that was a date. It was bronze. What can I say? I couldn't do anything. So are we married? Did we get married? Did it mess it up? Uh, good compatibility, soulmates. Did you not get married? <sighs> what is wrong with this game? Let's try this again, please. Did we get married now? Are we good? Two days. Did you did you really get married though? Oh, divorce. You're married. No, you're not gonna eat. I don't care who you are. You're coming in here and doing some laps. And you need to go to the bathroom, bud. Go to the bathroom, take a cold shower. Certificate of marriage. Uh, right there. Number nine. Are you still frozen? Yeah, you are. She's like, I can't do anything. There we go. Yuki's here. She's like, I have to pee. And you're cold. She's freezing to death. Are we going to get a different death? Ooh. Do it, do it. Freeze to death, freeze to death. Watch the stars with Briley. Well, she's kind of busy right now. Yay! <laughs> She's freezing to death. <laughs> well, that was fun. <laughs> uh, 
gloomy. Oh, you're gloomy. I mean, it makes sense. You're totally embracing the change. Apollo is now gloomy. You have lost 10 wives to that Deadpool. <laughs> that death trap. <laughs> but then again, she didn't die from the pool. She died from being cold. Why do you have a rabbit? You didn't die from a rabbit. Yuki? I don't know. I just play the game. <laughs> it makes no sense to me whatsoever. Now where's Grim? Grimmy Poo. Serial monogamous. Mono monog monogamous. Death is inevitable. Apollo knows that. Apollo just didn't think that he would be thinking about it so soon. There's still so much to do. How will Apollo get everything done if death is just right around the corner? Is it safer to hide just forever? Perform marriages in 20 unique households. Well, that's number 10. What do you think we should do with Apollo now? Our lady killer Apollo. And number 10 will go right here above the door. And her urn will go right here. Oops, up on the top. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> All right. Okay, guys, that wraps it up for Apollo. He is complete. What do you guys want to do next? He's gloomy now, so do we do we actually find him the love of his life or just let it go? I was kind of thinking about having him marry Kathleen and she actually kills him because she's noncommittal. But, I don't know. It technically wasn't really his fault. It was the death pool that killed them all. Except for freezing to death and the woohoos. And overexertion. But, yeah. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know in the comments below what you want to do. And we'll do that after, well... Depends on what you want to do. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. If you haven't already done so, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel if you enjoy the content I have on my channel. Also, make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss an episode. If you have any thoughts or ideas that you would like to see, let me know in the comments below. I hope you're all having a great day or night, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. Take care and toodles.